Painted from the same brush as their Mushroom Kingdom counterpart, there's no better Echo Fighter for Piranha Plant than the awkwardly named Deku Baba. To mimic the fighter's form factor with its beefier base, they could be placed in one of the series' trademark pots and sport small limbs based on the bio breeds native to Termina. In terms of attacks, these weeds are known to exhale fumes when on the offensive, which could offer a visual difference to their neutral special, and their spiky ball could be traded out for an oversized Chardon. To really grant them their own flair in the field, though, their up special could be functionally the same as Piranha Plant, but instead launch them like a Boku Baba's bud and descend with the elegance of a Deku Leaf. Depending on which rendition of the character is used, they could also summon a thematically fitting Diababa or Caldemos for their final smash, too. They might not be as widely recognized as their spotted contemporaries, but with a legacy stretching as far back as the original Zelda, they're more than up to the task of matching the plumber's plant. Hey there, pal. Thanks for watching. I know it's been mentioned that DLC characters wouldn't be Echo Fighters, but this was a fun character to consider nonetheless. If they actually made the cut, though, would you play them over Piranha Plant? Consider me curious.